Capital B deserve to be exposed. I have covered him enough. Lamidi Apapa. Now the news in full. Yesterday, the artist Shema of the Labour Party, Lamidi Apapa, was dragged out from the courtroom. After that, he was interviewed and he answered some questions intelligently, according to the news that was shared by Shannon on Twitter. Lamida Papa said that the Labour Party presidential candidate Peter B deserved to be exposed because he had he has literally covered him enough. He went for that to say that Peter B review he does not know him. But that is a lie. Like media, Papa called Peter B a liar because during his primary election in Asaba, he was present and he did the opening prayers. Like media, Papa said that that time he was the deputy national chairman of the Labour Party and not a junior officer. Like media, Papa made a statement saying, according to report, he said that when the Labour Party was formed, he started with the party and he has impacted positively in the party today. Lamida Papa said that he hasn't collected any bribe from anybody and, and anyone accusing him of it should prove it publicly. He went further to say that the boy who removed his cap in the court will suffer it because it is very disrespectful of him and this small thing I get for my listeners are there because it'll be your take or this at hand Peter B deserves to be exposed I have covered him enough Lamidi a papa please react to that if as you do so believe do justice to every of your reactions we talk about the virus opinion Already popping in for the comment section. The first one for Jasper Ushu Hepo. See what are you covering Peter B for? Even animals in the bush know that Peter B is innocent man. He has not he has not to be exposed. But see another old monkey called himself a papa after collected bribe from Tinibu Bola. Useless old kafu fool. The money you collected. Your family and you will not eat it. It is in it is in peace, okay? That your family and you will not eat it. It is in peace, okay? Don't be small thing. Hmm. Just believe that we respect their issue. Hmm. Respect their dignity, you can imagine. Then, then from uh, Ubani, Michael, what do you stand to gain? With all this thing you are doing, doing in of of you at this point in time, stand by a presidential candidate to save the whole country from being totally destroyed. You are rather causing more destruction to demand, and your party who paid you. You can imagine you know, the time that you're supposed to stand by your your presidential candidate. Eh? So that you can win the case, so that Nigeria can become what a better place to dwell in. You are trying. I don't know. In fact, hmm. God will come and hear this country. Oh. Then from Syrian, he says, "Stop fully your old age. How much were you given that is making you to disgrace yourself and your entire family members?" You can imagine. You can imagine. You can imagine. Then from Bewaji, so B is an unrepented liar. He think he can deceive the entire country with fake statistics and propaganda. I have one shoe. Go and verify. I have one part. One pound. Go and verify. If he likes, let him go to Supreme Court of Congo. We will never come out with anything. Hmm. Hmm. He will never come out with anything. Who said so? Hmm. Now you be God. Now God talk. I've been a human be talking. So long now God report, now we believe. And God is involved in the case, involved in this country's uh, issues. Can you can you actually stop God? No. Think of this now. We are wrapping it. Please endeavor to subscribe to this channel and also ensure that you share the very news to social media platform. Because you do so believe the Almighty God will do the very need for your life. Bye bye.